Welcome back, everybody, to uh, Let's Play Mass Effect Legendary Edition. I'm Gr Grandpa Gaming, and this will now actually be the start of episode 30 and the start of the final mission to uh, finish out Mass Effect 2. And uh, we'll be playing the Arrival DLC. <laughs> Need to get out of the system. I think I have everything, Audrey. Percent explored except for uh, where we have to go for this mission now. That's the uh, Viper Nebula. I have not been here before, so let's go hit all these planets up real fast, get them all broke down, and uh, we'll be 100% on exploring everything. Just making sure there's nothing in the asteroid belt. I'm just doing this so I can say 100% at all the planets. Probe launched. inside an oven. Hmm, that's a good description. Really makes me want to visit this planet. And I can't take anybody along on this one. Maddox, Cimitar, yeah, standard loadout. This is a solo mission off the start. Been a while since I played it. Yep, Baron. Baron. The Vitarians must send their prisoners down here to die. I have to find Dr. Kenson now. Bunch of dead Baron down here. for a prison. Get the human question. Get your hands off me! Let's explore around a bit.
cutting this do for me? I don't think anything. Yeah, I didn't do anything. I can't even get down there. Alright. So it looks like I have to go up that staircase anyway. That took longer than it should have. We can use this. I hear humans are scurrying like vermin out in the asteroid belt. Is anywhere safe from them? We should arm a mission to flush them all out. Now nah, we're coming for your asses first. my timer to see how long this was going to take. Well, 
Uh, and iridium didn't exactly need that. I could have snuck past these guys if I'd wanted to. Alright. But that is not how I play. It is death to all comers. Come on. Now drop the damn thing. Well, I need to move that one out of the way. Oh 
Don't let Gillum be nutted <clears throat> by me. Ah, come on. What the hell? How the hell did I miss all those shots? Henson, I'm Commander Shepard. I'm here to get you out. Commander Shepard, I'd heard you were alive. Hackett must have received my message. We're looking at a major diplomatic incident that the Batarians find out I was involved. This evidence had better be worth it. It is. The Reapers are coming. Diplomacy is the least of our worries. If we can find a console, I can hack security. Make us an escape path. Then we'll find them. Go. Ready. I guess you gotta go this way. No. Oh. Enough thousand credits. Not like I needed it, but. Cell block. There should be a security console here somewhere. It's a long way down. Let's not go there. They know we're here. Keep them off me while I hack us a way out. Easier said than done. Come on. 
came in through. Keep them out. They're coming through that door in the back. Lock it down. Which goddamn door? Closed. Well, what Damn, get to it. Damn it. They know we're here. Keep them off. It's me while I hack us away out. Support the team to cell block now. in through. Keep. They're coming up from below. They're coming through that door. Other side. Go. like I did last time and catch them before they get through. We need to close the door we came in through. Keep them out. They're, they're coming up from below. Other side, go. side. More enemies on the elevators. There's an elevator that leads up to the hangar. I'll bring it down. Almost done. Did it. Let's move. Get to the hangar. Do not let them escape. Made that a little harder than it should have been. Get the hell over here, Doctor. It's time to leave. 
Oh, one last thing. The hangar doors are hard locked. We'll have to get those open the old-fashioned way. Leave that to me. Incoming! autopilot. We should be well out of range before they get their security measures unscrambled. Do you think they'll come after you? I'm not taking any chances. Batarians don't take kindly to humans who plan to destroy their mass relays. So the charges against you are true? Well, to be fair, that's about half the story. My people and I were here investigating rumors of Reaper technology out in the fringes of this system. I guess you found some. We found proof that the Reapers will be arriving in this system. When they get here, they'll use its mass relay to travel throughout the galaxy. We call it the Alpha Relay. From here, the Reapers can invade anywhere in the galaxy. So you decided to destroy it? Exactly. Doing that would stop the Reapers' invasion. Even at FTL speeds, it'd be months or years before they got to the next relay. We came up with what we just called the Project. A plan to launch a nearby asteroid into the relay and destroy it before the Reapers could arrive. Of course, the resulting explosion would probably wipe out the system. Why do you think destroying the mass relay would destroy the entire system? Mass relays are the most powerful mass effect engines in the known galaxy. The energy released from a relay's destruction would probably resemble a supernova. This is a remote system. But just over 300,000 Batarians live on the colony where they held us. The explosion would undoubtedly kill them all. How did you plan to launch an asteroid into a mass relay? Moving an asteroid just requires thrust and guidance, which are readily available in Omega's salvage yards. Get the right amount of power and a good VI to drive it, and you can pretty much just point and shoot. I've always heard that mass relays are indestructible. I've heard that too but I think it's more that nobody's willing to find out what happens when one is destroyed. And, well, we plan to slam a small planet into the thing at very high speed. By our calculations, that's more than enough. 
Is the project still operational? I... I imagine it is. We were one button press away from launch when the Batarians arrested me. How were you caught? We've been smuggling Starship parts from Omega. Thrusters, guidance, an aftermarket ESO core. The Batarians thought that looked suspicious. A few days ago, I took a few of the men on a scouting trip, and the Batarians pounced on us. They never found our actual base. I still don't see how you learned about this supposed invasion. The evidence came from what we call Object Row, a Reaper artifact we discovered among the asteroids near the relay itself. When we get back to Arcturus Station, I'll explain everything and provide copies of all our notes on the artifact. What is a Reaper artifact doing on an asteroid? We don't know, or even what its purpose is. Some things are just too old or large to comprehend. Even a Reaper thousands of years dead contains power. Their artifacts are worthy of study, regardless of their purpose. How exactly does a Reaper artifact give you proof of an impending invasion? It showed me visions of the Reaper's arrival. Much like your Prothean beacon, I imagine. The Reapers are coming, Commander. That much I know for certain. If you're working near a Reaper artifact, how have you avoided indoctrination? We've been very careful. We know what we're dealing with. You're not speaking to a child, Shepard. I saw what Sovereign did at the Citadel. Trust me, I know what's at stake. The stakes are too high. If you were willing to destroy a whole system over this, I want to see your proof. I guess I can't argue with that. Give me a moment. Kenson to Project Base. Affirmative. And I've got Commander Shepard with me. Shepard? Really? Tidy up the lab. The Commander needs to confirm the artifact. Yeah, that don't sound suspicious all at all. Just sit back and relax. We'll be there in no time. Here we are. Welcome to Project Base. What's this? That's our countdown to arrival. When that gets to zero, the Reapers will have come. Just over two days and counting. Puts things in perspective, doesn't it? How do you know that's an accurate countdown? It is. The artifact has been giving off pulses at definite intervals since we found it. The intervals have been decreasing at a steady rate. The artifact is reacting to the Reapers' proximity. In just over 48 hours, the pulses will become constant, and the Reapers will be here. You're saying the Reapers could be at Earth in two days? There's no time to waste. Then let's show you that proof. That door exits the hangar. The artifact is in our central lab area. Anything around her? There we go. Take that. Always worth looking around. Ooh. And when it gives you a chance to choose your loadout, you know something's wrong. Well, let's get rid of the cane. Sometimes. A lot of locked doors. So what would it take to get the project back up and running? Everything was in place when we were arrested. It wasn't a question of could we, but should we? What alternative do we have? The Reapers will reach this system regardless. 
but the Alpha Relay is their shortcut to the rest of the galaxy. If you want to keep the Reapers at bay, this Relay must be destroyed. We have to get the project running again. It's probably the only chance we have. One sec. Let me get the door. That's kind of beautiful looking. I give you object row. You have the Reaper artifact just sitting here? Out in the open? When we found it, it showed me a vision of the Reaper's arrival. Kenson, this is not good. Give it a moment, Shepard. It'll give you the proof you need. She's fucking indoctrinated. I can't let you start the project, Shepard. I can't let you stop the arrival. Very difficult. Do not resist. Give yourself over and No glitch. The sedatives aren't working. Security! Hello, boys. Kicking in. How 
these things are there? Max, I don't care. I play rock and sock and robots. Except with guns. Everybody on the station and in the system. So I have the adrenaline rush and I can just drop them all one shot. Surprised not activating all these mechs. Probably shouldn't say that.
fears are coming, she says. But I'm not sure if I'm hearing fear or hope in her voice. That's it, run away from me. I'm not going to get through, but uh, I'm getting through pretty easy, actually. The longer we're here, the more I'm convinced that the project must be stopped. We simply don't know enough about what the Reapers want. It's foolish to assume that the Reapers mean doom for the galaxy. Legends say they've come through before, and yet life continues, doesn't it? Oh, you poor indoctrinated fool. This is a big goddamn station. How are they hiding this from the Batarians? This is huge. That guy's still alive. these people are sending at me.
I gotta take those guys down first. Ugh. Those guys have definitely gotta die first. Get in there now. No deal. left. Welcome to Project Control. I want to activate the project. Warning. Activating the project will result in an estimated 305,000 casualties. Do you wish to continue? get to you first. All right. <clears throat> Nothing I love more than killing mad scientists. <sighs> because this game is just full of them. Don't try to stop me, Shepard. I have to do this. Stop now, Kinsey. Hackett's friend or not, I will kill you. You're forcing my hand, Shepard. You know that. There is no escape. There's no redemption for what you've done. 
I will die, never having seen the Reaper's blessings. And you will just die. Damn it, kids. I need ammo now. There we go. How do I stabilize the reactor core? All automatic safety protocols have been overwritten. To stabilize the reactor core, manually insert cooling rod A from this control station. Manually insert cooling rod B from control station B. Doing so will stabilize the reactor core. Cooling rod A reinserted. Reactor cooling process has begun. I need more time. Get in there. this door. Anything in here? I know I'm in zero. Is that it? Yep. Some of these uh, guys' faces, they just look like jerk offs. This is Williams. I've got Shepard low to the maintenance area, requesting backup. We've been spotted. Ain't got me locked nowhere, buddy. 
Security log overwritten. Commander Shepard, there ain't no stopping him. Paid him a lot of money, I actually don't need that. That wasn't cool. somewhere. Back there, just can't shoot him from here. Reactor temperature approaching critical. You burn. And there's a pyro right on the other side of the damn door. I got lucky that didn't kill me. I will definitely take the money. from the reactor. You've ruined everything. I can't hear the whispers anymore. Turn around. Now! You've taken them away from me. I will never see the Reaper's arrival. All you had to do... <laughs> Shit. Warning. 
Collision imminent. <laughs> Warning. Collision imminent. 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 Joker, this is Shepard. I need a pickup. Now. Communication system damaged. Damn it. Evacuation protocols in effect. All personnel report to escape shuttles. Where can I find an escape shuttle? Take the lift from this room to the external access. From there, proceed to the communications tower. The remaining escape shuttles will be located on the tower's landing pad. I have to get to that comm tower and take a shuttle. It's my only chance. I don't think there was any need to say that out loud. I wonder if anybody even still left alive on this station. I think I've killed almost everybody already. There's still goddamn guys alive out here. And there's a timer on this fight. Cool, you can see the relay getting closer. That is cool looking. External 
comm channel open. Shepard to Normandy. Joker, do you read me? Shepard, you have become an annoyance. You fight against <laughs> netherability, <laughs> dust struggling against cosmic winds. This seems a victory to you. A star system sacrificed, but even now, your greatest civilizations are doomed to fall. Your leaders will beg to serve us. Yes. People will die. Maybe we'll lose half the galaxy. Maybe more. But I will do whatever it takes to rid the galaxy of the Reaper threat. However insignificant we might be. We will fight. We will sacrifice. And we will find a way. That's what humans do. Know this as you die in vain. Your time will come. Your species will fall. Prepare yourselves for the arrival. Commander Shepard, Normandy inbound for pickup. Roger that. Wasn't the destruction of a star system, I'd say it's quite lovely looking. He's definitely the most dangerous character in all these games. Good military huh. commander and a Looks like you've recovered. Politician. Admiral Hackett. Sounds like you went through hell down there. How are you feeling? Fine. No more visions, if that's what you mean. I wasn't expecting to see you here. You went out there as a favor to me. I decided to debrief you in person. That was before the mass relay exploded and destroyed an entire Batariot system. What the hell happened out there, Commander? Have you received any intel about what happened? All I know is I sent you out there to break Amanda Kenson out of prison. And now an entire system is destroyed. I hope you could fill in the leap of logic between those two events. Kenson said the Reapers were the galaxy's salvation. Then she captured and sedated me and held me against my will. She wasn't willing to stop the invasion, so I did what had to be done. Sounds like Amanda was indoctrinated. Well, that's a damn shame. And you believe the Reaper invasion really was a threat? No doubt about it. We literally had minutes to spare. I'm sure all the details are in your report. I won't lie to you, Shepard. The Batarians will want blood, and there's just enough evidence for a witch hunt. And we don't want war with the Batarians, not with the Reapers at the galaxy's edge. What are you saying? You did what you did for the best of reasons, but there were more than 300,000 Batarians in that system, all dead. Any sacrifice is worth stopping a Reaper invasion. I happen to agree with you. I'm sorry those Batarians lost their lives, but someone has to make the difficult decisions that get people killed. Unfortunately, not everyone will see it that way. So what do you suggest? 
evidence against you is shoddy at best. But at some point, you'll have to go to Earth and face the music. I can't stop it, but I can and will make them fight for it. I didn't expect to see you aboard a Cerberus vessel. I don't like Cerberus or the way they do things. But they brought you back to life, and they're actually doing something about the state of the galaxy. So for now, I can be friendly. Is the Alliance concerned about the Batarians' response to this incident? Very. The Batarians have been looking for an excuse to wage war on us since we showed up in the galaxy. If the Reapers invade, we need the galaxy to work together. If we're at war with the Batarians, the other races will be hesitant to give aid to either side. Is the Alliance prepared for a Reaper invasion? That's hard to say. It took multiple fleets and the Destiny Ascension to bring Sovereign down, and that was just one Reaper. If the Reapers come in force, we're just not ready. I stop a Reaper invasion and they want to put me up on charges? It's not a matter of preference, Shepard. You'll be a convenient scapegoat for avoiding open war. Do whatever you have to do out here. But when Earth calls, you make sure you're there with your dress blues on, ready to take the hit. In the meantime, you keep this. I don't need to see a report to know you did the right thing. Plausible deniability that he was even there. Yes, sir. You've done a hell of a thing, Commander. Showed up in person, so there's no transmissions, no proof he was involved. Admiral Hackett is the scariest man. I was saying before all that uh, ending music right there, Admiral Hackett is the scariest man in this entire series, and I think everybody overlooks him. He's a very good politician, a very good war leader, and he knows how to play all sides and keep his hands clean while doing it. Probably give the elusive man a run for the money with his right with the right resources. Yeah. Now let's see if we can go get any of that research that we picked up. I don't think I think so though. Oh, we can use the skin weed. Yeah, I think we've upgraded everything now. So actually, uh, that's it. That was the uh, last DLC for uh, Mass Effect 2. So uh, next episode, we'll be starting uh, Mass Effect 3. Uh, if you're a new viewer, returning viewer, you've not yet subscribed, please think about hitting that subscribe button. If you do, remember to hit that bell icon so you alert when the next videos come out. If you follow along with the series and join the content, please remember to hit that like button. Also, comments, comments, comments. Please let me know the good, the bad, the ugly. Uh, feedback is always a positive. It'll help me grow this channel a little better. And I will see you all at the next episode.